Yeah, guys, that's correct. Well, inspiration and motivation were the two key words that I heard from all of these students in the classroom today. They were able to take a little bit of time from their classes to watch this local inspiration receive this great award. It's very inspiring. Sitting in a classroom thousands of miles from all the celebration around the event in D.C., but they watched knowing that Steve Gleason's story still wasn't far from them. Gleason sat in many of the same classrooms as these students. It's crazy to think that um, everything that he's gone through and all of the people that he's impacted and he's kind of been in the same place as me. They say seeing his path and journey to where he is now shows them that they can overcome obstacles. Even now, as he's still dealing with his disease, he's still making a big change. And uh, as long as you have that drive and uh, passion and work ethic, there's really nothing that can stop you from making a difference. Zandre is one of several students who took a trip to New Orleans two years ago for a social justice class. While they were there, they learned about how people in the city were still recovering from Hurricane Katrina, but they also got to meet Gleason in person and hear his message of perseverance. It's a motivation especially that he started his roots here at Gonzaga Prep. He's a great example of being a beacon of like light, um, love, passion, and work ethic, especially in the face of adversity. Now, as these students prepare for graduation, many of them continuing on to college, watching this ceremony is showing them a greater example of dedication. I'm just a teenager just like him, or how he was, and... Um, um, it just shows like anyone can do anything. I want to continue to live up to his motto of no white flags. Posters and other items celebrating Gleason's career and work in its Hall of Fame. Students say that this serves as a daily reminder to them that they can overcome obstacles and achieve their dreams. Reporting in the newsroom, Shana Waltower, Crem 2 News.